Right, tonight we're going to see what we can do with one of these really annoying motion sensitive uh, ornaments. This one, if there's a change in the light, like a shadow goes over it, it sings to you, as you can hear. In fact, this one seems to be a bit oversensitive. I only have to move slightly in the background and it sets it off. Right, that's enough of that. Off. Okay, take it apart, leave that bit out that's um, hot glued in place. And that's the little light sensor or motion sensor, well light sensor really. That's the speaker and that's the circuit board and an on-off switch. I'll do some close-ups so you can see them better when I actually video this. My intention is to see if we can use this to make a little vibrating bug. So we'll take it apart, or we'll take bits off it, and see if we can do something with it. Right, put the macro lens on the camera. So hopefully, I think that's about the focal length. We can get a closer look at what we've got. Light sensor circuit board, speaker, on off switch. Enough of that. Right, not quite sure how much of this is in focus because my camera's got a very short focal length. I've actually pulled the circuit board off the hot glue so I can now get to the back of it. I've put my electric motor one leg is going to the contact that goes down to the battery, well via the switch. The other leg is going to one side of what was originally the speaker, but I've replaced it with a little LED. And now if a shadow goes over the detector, see the LED flashes and my motor vibrates. So I can stick it all back together and I should have a little vibrating bug that detects shadows or light, whichever way you want to look at it. So there we go. So all I've done to the original circuitry is replaced the speaker with an LED, which I may or may not leave there. And added an electric motor into the circuitry so that every time it activates the motor vibrates. And that's it. We'll stick it back together and see if we can make it look like a bug. Right, just straightening out a few paper clips to use as the legs and the hot glue gun warm up Probably don't need to watch me do that. Um, right, 
I've actually tidied up some of the old hot glue ready to put it up. I've cut a little slot there and stick the detector up there drilled a little hole over there for my little LED that just happens to fit through there so if I stick it together and then I'll put the legs on afterwards where it was originally. Hot glue there. Stick our detector through there. stick the motor. Depends how long my legs are for me. I just think that could go there somewhere. In fact I can probably catch some of the wires underneath it as well to keep them out of the way. Okay I've uh, bent myself up a few legs here to put on the bug. Before I do that, I'll just demonstrate it working. Right, settle down. If I now put a shadow over it, Okay, legs hot glued in place. That looks like a success. Tempting to spray paint it black, but uh, I'll leave it like that for now. Hope you enjoyed it.